Everyone wants to know, are you a natural athlete or a lie, Mr. Anderson? See, the body can only achieve so many gains naturally, and even in the Matrix, there's this stench of lies floating around this impossible landscape called YouTube fitness that just seems to be plaguing the people and it, it disgusts me Mr. Anderson that you dare claim that you are natural when clearly you can manipulate the matrix in ways no one else can seem to ever achieve. Are you the one? Or are you a fake natty? Let's find out. Alright everybody welcome back to the channel. I had to do that. I know I had to do it. I had to do it. Alright let me do my regular intro now. Bear with me. What's going on everybody? It's the baddest man on the planet, the human juggernaut himself, Damien Motherfucker McCloud, aka the Alpha Wolf. Now everyone wants to know who is Natty and who is not, and I have been recently asked to do a Natty or Not video on no other than Osama Obalor. Now, I'll say this, like I always say, disclaimer. I've never seen this guy or any other any other guy take any steroids, so I mean, I, I can't say for sure, you know. They, people want to know, are they uh, allegedly? People think allegedly he is. I've never seen him do anything, you know. <laughs> I've never seen it. I've never seen anyone. So I'll just say that, you know, it's alleged that these people are. But now let's dig into the facts and some of the reasons why people think that this guy here is a, a fake natty. We found the culprit. Ah! It was on my over our fake natty police. Get on the ground now. Why? What are you? You're under this? arrest. We see on YouTube you're a fake natty. No, I'm not. He says he's not. Well, what's the first thing you guys think when you see this picture here? Hmm. Doesn't scream natural. Now, I'm not going to bash the guy. You know, he's a nice guy. Let's say that right now. And this is by no means hating. But I do want to state some really solid facts here. When it comes to becoming a, like he says in this bio, IFBB Pro. In order to become an IFBB Pro, has anyone ever in the history, in the history of YouTube fitness ever seen a natural IFBB Pro? Oh, don't worry, I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait. Can someone email me? Should I check my email? Did anyone send me a reply? Huh? No, we've never seen one. I've never seen one. It's, it's it's like it's like a unicorn scuba diving <laughs> you're never gonna see that shit ever <laughs> all right so i mean obviously this guy is like insanely ripped and muscular to be a natural and have you know this type of muscle fullness and lena i've watched a ton of natty or not videos on this guy and, you know, after watching his video, you know, like, you know, he seems like a cool dude, you know, on a person to person level. So I'm not going to bash him. No hate. Like, I don't hate the guy. I'll say that. He seems like a cool dude. But, you know, like I said, when it comes to branding yourself and getting this attention, people are going to do whatever they need to do. You know, and everyone knows when a person is on YouTube and they're saying they're natural when they know they're not. You know, you have sponsors, this, that, and the third. You don't want to mess up the bag, all right? So we know you, you're trying to get the bag. It's about the paper. But then at the same time, when, you know, what messes it up is when a person does this. They claim natural bodybuilder. Now, we know Gymshark is full of fake natties. We know, you know, a lot of the, it's, it's just ridiculous on the web. I've done a few, you know, fake natty videos. I'm going to keep doing more. I'm going to blow the channel up with this thing. But as you can see here, clearly, I mean, come on. Come on. I'm at the gym every night. How many of these dudes do you see in the gym? You see a few guys who look like me. You know, like, you see me. Come on. Even on my on my thumbnail picture on my page, that's probably the leanest I've gotten in a while. And I didn't look like this. You know what I'm saying? This here... It's, it's screaming, you know, alternative fuel source. Let's scroll down here. We got the picture here. Now, in the soft season, he looks, you know, rather fluffy. That looks a little Photoshop, to be honest. But, you know, I mean, I I couldn't imagine this guy really putting on all that damn fat. I really do want to say that's some sort of a 
Photoshop skills at use uh, at work in this picture here. Now on the right side, clearly he looks bigger when he's um when, he, when he's lean, which is a sign of something that's going on. Now here's a video of him doing his alien games, which he's famous for. Like I said, cool guy, no hate. Here's the alien games. Crazy, right? That's insane. So apparently that's some disorder that you know a few people get where you can control your muscle spasms to a certain that's degree. freaking alien games man yeah you know to a certain degree but when it comes to you know just being at this young of an age putting on that much muscle you don't see guys who are 19 20 21 with that much muscularity it just doesn't happen now later on in your 20s 25 26 27 that's when you've you know you put in the work over the years and you developed no one's gonna put on these crazy crazy amount of muscle in this short amount of time it just doesn't happen we're just gonna flip through a few pictures here and so I get to that transformation picture I've seen a few guys put that transformation picture in their video and you know it, it's it's just obvious now you know come on come on now, I want to scroll I want to find it now here we go right here right here right here here we go now this clearly looks like you know um, what's that guy chest bra with the black line <laughs> this is a whole other video in itself now clearly he has the shape here, you know what I'm saying, for the muscularity. You can see he has, you know, some minor genetics for it, minor genetics, but yeah, come on. In just a few years, this much muscle size, 15 versus 21, that's six years. That's six years. Come on now, come on. Apparently, the guy is saying, you know, I've seen a, was it a picture where he was like 18? He was almost that big. You don't put on this much muscle. That much muscle that fast. Now if he was like 26, 27, then yeah, naturally, yeah. But come on, he's 21 in this in this picture here. He's saying, now at 19, was he closer to the smaller size or was he closer to this size? Because at 19, 18, 17, come on, it's just not enough time. You gotta use time as a factor, people. So it's, it's very important you know but like I say a lot of people out there in the world man they get fooled by these internet sensations you know what I'm saying and like I said there's nothing wrong with branding yourself man there's nothing wrong with being an IFBB pro if that's what you want to do go for it man but you know what I'm saying everyone knows when you get to that level you're on something you cannot compete at that level and not be on something you just can't I mean look at this come on he looks bigger when he cuts down Come on, man. Like, you put on muscle mass. It's just, it's just, it just screams alternative fuel source usage. Allegedly, I say allegedly, like I say, because no one knows for sure. No one's ever, no one's ever saw him. There's no video footage. But, I mean, just come on. It's common sense, guys. Like I said, nice guy, man. He has a ton of, he has a ton of subs. Like, he even said in one of the videos I've seen that someone put up about him. You know, he, he'll do anything for the game. He'll do something for the games, allegedly. You know what I mean? So... When it comes to this notoriety, you know, it brings him a lot of attention, the alien games, the fact that he's now an IFBB pro. Um, it builds you a really nice following. And in order to keep this following, to keep that prestige, you have to have some sort of edge. And not just him, I'm not just put this is like for all the guys out there that people are calling out to be fake natties. People aren't dumb. You know what I'm saying? Like people the people who call me a fake natty is not even like a really big part of the community, even though I'm not really like super known. It's really just a few trolls. They come with the gyno jokes and shit. I'm like, there's no way I can get gyno if I don't take steroids. So I just have like a massive upper chest. And see, that's what wants to. That's what makes me want to give some of these guys the benefit of the doubt. As if you know they didn't have this crazy, insane look. You can't blame all of this on lighting. You know what I'm saying? This isn't always lighting. You know what I'm saying? I have a large amount of chest muscle. And I know that I worked out hard, tons of reps, tons of sets, but it takes hella time. Hella time. It's not something that happens in two years, three years. And, you know, understand something, people. I'm, I'm trying, I, I love just putting this out there. When people say noob gains, noob gains don't take you from, let me find that, that picture again, from this to this in a short amount of time. That shit takes years. Noob gains will mean like a little bit of muscle on the arms, a little bit of shoulders, a little bit more chest. Not that much muscle on the arm. That's not noob gains. That's like 
veteran amount of muscle, veteran gains. That's the type of shit that takes like 10 years. So when you see a guy putting that on three, four, five years, in this case he says 15 to 21, which is really probably like 20 because he probably just turned 21 in this picture, you know. You have to be 21 for a whole year to be really considered 21. You get what I'm saying? It's like it takes time. Every year counts. You know, that all counts. It's just, it's impossible for anyone. And you know, we see this over and over again. You got to give respect to uh, the guys out there like Brandon Harding, who just comes out and says, hey, I never claimed Natty. Now, he's not claiming to be on anything. But he says, hey, I never claimed Natty. So, you know, y'all miss me with that Natty or not shit. <laughs> miss me with that shit. I'm not claiming Natty. I'm just doing my thing. And like I said, man, you know, shout out to Ozoma. You know, do your thing, man. I hope, I'll, you know, I hope... You get all the accolades you're going for, man. No hate. Don't ever want to see nobody fall off. But, you know, it's just when people put out their natty, when they're not natty, man, it's just you don't need to do it. Just don't even speak on it, man. Like the Brandon Harding dude. He just came out and said, hey, I never claimed this shit. I just lift weights. I do what I do. I compete. He even said, man, listen, to be at that level, this is the Brandon guy. He says, to be at that level and to compete against guys who you know are on stuff, Come on, you gotta, you know, if you're gonna play the game, you gotta play the game, baby. <laughs> That's just the bottom line. If you're gonna play the game, you gotta play the game. You know what I'm saying? And this guy, you're obviously playing the game. So don't lie about the rules of the game, buddy. You just keep it 100. But yeah, I hope you guys liked the video. I wanna cut this short. Don't wanna do too much talking, man. This video's already kinda exceeded its limits. So if you haven't already done so, don't forget to like comment and subscribe 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 i'm subliminally in your mind i'm gonna be doing a lot more natty or not videos i might even rehash some videos at some point in time pointing out minor things there is one guy i want to do a natty or not video on. i'm not going to say who he is yet then i want to critique something that this person does lift wise if you guys know who that person is you might know they kind of got called out recently for some some uh questionable activities in the fitness industry so Anyway, with all of that said, people, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and also get to the gym, do work, and muscle up. My adversaries cry like hoes, fully eradicate my foes. My lyrics explode on contact, came in you hoes. Who else but mama's only son? Put the phony niggas up, uh, say my name, watch bitches come. Now fire when ready, stay watching now.